in this question we have to prove that the sum of these terms is equal to 5 so clearly we will do it or solve it using rationalizing the denominator so I'll start with the first part it is 1 over 3 minus under root 8 so I'll keep rationalizing simultaneously so it is will be rationalized by multiplying dividing with 3 plus under root 8 as you know that if it, your denominator is in the form of a minus b we multiply divided by a plus b next there is a minus sign this is 1 over under root 8 minus under root 7 so here we will simplify i mean rationalize by multiplying with 8 plus under root 7 uh, this is 8 plus under root 7 the next term which is plus 1 over under root 7 minus under root 6 so we'll again rationalize by multiplying dividing by under root 7 plus under root 6 under root 7 plus under root 6 what you can see here that uh, we are still left with some terms that is this is minus 1 over under root 6 1 over under root 6 minus under root 5 so here too we will be rationalizing by multiplying dividing by root 6 plus root 5 divided by root 6 plus root 5 for the last part this is 1 over under root 5 minus 2 so clearly we'll be multiplying dividing it by under root 5 plus 2 and under root 5 plus 2 now consider this the first part here this is 1 multiplied by 3 plus root 8 so this will give you This will give you 3 plus root 8 and the denominator as you can see it is uh, a square a square minus b square as your denominator is in the form of a minus b into a plus b so a square minus b square that is 3 square 3 square minus under root a square so that is 3 square is 9 9 minus 8 minus under root 8 plus under root 7 for this part we are getting 8 minus 7, keeping them in a bracket. For this, the numerator is 1 multiplied by root 7 plus root 6. And the denominator, which is root 7 square, is 7. So 7 minus 6. For this, it is root 6 plus root 5 multiplied by 1. So it is root 6 plus root 5 only. That divide root 5, root 6 plus root 5. That divided by a square minus b square. So root 6, six square is 6 minus root 5 square is 5. So we had this minus sign here, that minus sign. Now for this, this is root 5 plus 2 that divided by root 5 square is 5 minus 2 square is 4. Now for the remaining part, I'll write it here. Let's say I'll write it here. But you can see that 9 minus 1 is 8. Everywhere you can see that the denominator we are getting as 1. This is 1. 8 minus 7 is 1. This is 1. This is 1. This is 1. And any number divided by 1 is the number itself. So we're simply writing the numerator part. The numerator for the first, it is 3 under root 8. And then there is a minus sign. So when we open this bracket, it will be minus under root 8 minus under root 7. For this, if you open the bracket, it is remains under root 7 plus under root 6. And if I open this bracket, we get minus under root 6 minus under root 5 and for this it is under root positive under root 5 plus 2. Now what you can see here that uh, under root 8 my under root minus 8 get cancelled this is also getting cancelled 
under root 5, negative under root 5 plus positive under root 5. So we are just left with 3 plus 2. And 3 plus 2 is equal to 5. And that is what the RHS, right? We had to prove this is, is equal to 5. And we got this as 5 only.